Oh, looks like we have a cutscene here. So we have Robin's cutscene. Looks like she is all alone. Hi, Snap. I was just cleaning some dust off my saw. And what is up, beautiful people of planet Earth? Let's say hi to Eggnog. He is so happy, but we're planning to get a new pet. Hopefully, they'll get, along, uh, get well along. Get along well, I mean. <laughs> anyway, I just drank coffee. That's why, you know. And uh, if you look at that, our plants are growing. They're so happy. They're waving their hands all over the place. Let's just plant them all. And oh, I forgot. I need to say hi to our chickens. And um, later on, I'm going to show you guys something that's really cool. First, let's tend to our beloved fried chickens. <laughs> Although I call them every time like food, I see them as food, but they're, they're, they're very close to my heart. I just see them as food. That's it. Because I love to take care and eat chicken. <laughs> oh, I missed one more egg here. And would you look at that, guys? Our amaranth has grown so gracefully. And by the way, if you don't mind me asking, please do like, subscribe to help me grow the channel and let, to let the people know how wonderful Stardew Valley is, because it will help YouTube push the game that we're playing to other people around the world which might need to play this game because it's just so awesome and relaxing and also thank you so much for being here i know there are uh other cooler youtube content creators for starter valley and you chose to be here that's why i, I really i feel so humbled by that and i i thank you so much for for being here okay done watering our plants what to do next <laughs> and every time i i'm done watering the plants doing this farm chores that's the time when i i i my, my brain just stopped working because i'm not that creative when it comes to doing tasks i am more of a person that relies to a game that says do this do that i'm used to that but that's why that's the whole fun thing about starting valley as well it lets it stimulates your brain to think on what to do next which may uh, probably will make you more creative so before I decide things, uh, let's gather information first. Uh, let's see. Uh, don't know where to find Linus's basket. Hopefully you guys tell me in the comments. And uh, yeah, we're waiting for the amaranth to grow so we can give it to uh, Marnie. Uh, oh, Demetrius needs a melon. Okay, that's good. At least we have a task for today. But uh, let's see if we have a melon. Oh, no. oh there you go. This, dim, this yummy melon straight going to Linus or Demetrius. And uh, let's see, uh, today uh, the spirits are kind of neutral, I think. So uh, I don't know, I don't know what to do. I will, maybe we'll go ahead and uh, do the mines. But first let's go to a place where I, oh yeah, I told you guys that I will show you something real, really cool, right? Let's see. And there you go, our house is finished. I know you guys already know about this, but <laughs> for me, this is a huge achievement as a new player of Stardew Valley because it will let me cook. Oh man, this is so cool, look at this. I wonder what kind of meal is, that's easy to cook and very helpful early game. So I think fried egg. Oh yeah, because it will add like 50 energy and 22 health. And its cost is 35 gold. And uh, we're, we do have egg and we have uh, milk. So yeah, we, we have a uh, unlimited egg from our pretty chickens. And uh, we can also cook omelette. Uh, we don't have milk though. Let's see, uh, any egg meal that we could cook or oh, what else uh, parsnip soup i don't have any parsnips for now so most likely this is gonna be our go-to food <laughs> fried egg as usual in real life irl that's my, one of my favorite as well early morning so we have wheat floor oh yeah a wheat floor and an egg we can do pancakes i think oh it will add like plus two foraging for the pancakes awesome so do we do we need to put uh things here inside the fridge so we could we could cook oh i'm not sure but uh maybe well i'll go ahead and do that oh looks like we have a cutscene here so we have robin's cutscene looks like she is all alone hi snap i was just cleaning some dust off my saw have you ever made anything out of wood snap uh, yes i did actually leah did uh <laughs> did a sculpture for me from wood and its title is oh no i'm still i'm too shy to say it but it's entitled oh, what i feel about you snap which is really sweet great then this blueprint should be a piece of cake for you oh okay this is interesting nice thanks so much robin i think we've become a good enough friends that i can trust you with my carpentry secrets oh boy this is wonderful here let me show you the blueprints oh man i'm, I'm so humbled by this learn how to craft flute block and drum drum block okay sounds interesting you can use these to get creative on your own farm it feels good to be able to decorate your house with things you've made yourself aha nice and uh well she likes melons but we need to give this melon to demetrius and by the way robin you did a great job in the house kitchen it, it's it's so spacious it just fits the its purpose i love it so much maybe you like this one this uh, uh what's this i forgot its name hazelnut let's see if she likes it thank you this might come handy <laughs> You like it so much. Oh, hey, Sebastian. Oh. <laughs> what time is it? I 
think I slept too much last night. Yeah, I, I think so. I think the microphone is too loud. I don't know. Okay, uh, Demetrius is nowhere to be seen. Let's just head straight to... Oh, Linus is here. I was just thinking about a daffodil. That's a good find. I'm always happy when eating wild food. Thank you. You're welcome. I don't have many responsibilities, so I spend my time thinking. Wow, that's life. You have to understand your thoughts before you can control them. Hmm, understand your thoughts. So the thing is, how can we understand a thought? This is the, There's what they call... Uh, you have to separate yourself away from yourself. So you can look at your, the other, not only your the other people's perspective, but also how you think. So you can you can see how you think and maybe make some adjustments based on what, what will work best, not only for us or for you, but for other people around you. And Demetrius is so happy. This is perfect. It's just what I need for my research. It's going to be hard not to eat it. <laughs> Thanks a bunch. You're welcome. Let's see. Perhaps the nitrogen fixation level is affected by nema. Toad secretions. Oh, sorry, I'm pondering. Yeah, I don't know about it. But, uh, oh, we have here a hazelnut and, uh, oh, an oak tree. Okay, let's head straight to the mines. We do have three iron bars here. Let me just collect him. We also have a refined quartz. And a uh, good thing we found ourselves a forest a sword, which is very, very strong early game. Now let's head straight to, oh, I'm at level 60. Hey, hey. Nice, let's go down at least five. Oh, oh, there's a lot of enemies. A lot of monsters at this level right off the bat. Let's get rid of this slime because it's going to be so annoying if this slows us down. Yeah, look, just like that. It's so annoying. Uh -huh, there you go. And these little guys here I, I these guys remember reminds me of uh the dust you know the you watch the movie spirited away from ghibli studios which i love to watch with my daughter and my wife uh yeah these are the you remember the in the boiler room when she went there to ask a job from the person with a lot of uh, legs and arms yeah those dust those black balls looks like that i think uh concerned ape had a lot of reference from ghibli studio movies as well oh the stairs going down we are now at 62 oh oh it's gonna be an infested area for how many minutes hopefully we'll survive guys okay let's just stay near the stairs in case we we run out of hp so we can run escape right away what i don't like about this uh events like a, oh at least we have a ladder going down now is that the uh, oh solar essence okay what i don't like about infested area although i love combat but it just delays me from going going down especially that our time and energy as are very limited but at least we got here uh, an iron ore Nice. Let's go on and check further if we, there's more irons at this area. Yeah, there's more. Oh, wait. Oh, it just broke. Who broke it? I did not. I didn't, I didn't break that ore, but it, when I arrived, it's already it has already been mined. All I have to do is to pick it up. Nice. And also we have a stairs going down here. We have three slimes, a bat. I want to get rid of the bat first. Oh, no, I don't mean to fish. I want to, to sword you. There you go. The bat is down. This slime is just so annoying. Oh, we have four calls from from the box i think we're gonna do three more hits to get rid of this pesky go uh oh. ghost oh one more hit okay i wonder what's the best weapon for cave diving i heard that uh the best weapon is uh the one that does an area of effect damage aoe uh i think that's gonna be what type of weapon uh the uh the club type of weapon uh well i have to try that for myself if that is kind of my taste but i think that will work as well because if the, there's a lot of uh, monsters most of the monsters here will just go towards you they will mob you and uh, the best and most uh, practical way is to deal damage with them one at a time well, not one at a time but at the same time so i think uh, a weapon that has an aoe damage works best and we have here at the lower part we have a <laughs> A copper ore and also an iron here or here. Not bad. And uh, stairs going down. We're so lucky today. I almost did not notice that uh, our HP and uh, the energy is going down rapidly. Uh, let's just eat the snack bar a bit. Maybe three of them. Uh, maybe two because it's already like 11 p.m. Oh, I need, we need to go. We need to go uh, one more level down to get to the elevator. Let's get rid of this ghost first. Now we are sleepy. Please. Please, Lord, please. Hopefully, I'll find the stairs right uh, as soon as I can. It's now 12 a.m. No! Ah, oh, it's too much. Please. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. We are uh, we are no longer in control of the time. One thing that is that taught me 
well in life and also in video games that if you are almost like not no longer in control that's the perfect time to stay away because it's a sign that you are about to experience something that is not good if you are not in control although totally you are not in control for the whole thing but at least for the few things that you are in control you should be in control but if you're not in control like for example the time we're not in control of that but we're in control of where to position ourselves in case time runs out and uh oh boy just one more just one more one more we have to run we have to run oh i think i'm gonna faint again no they made a very bad decision and i i and i even have the, the confidence to, to to share some teachings <laughs> and then i just fainted <laughs> that's funny and we just fainted i'm really good at that that's one of my uh mastery in stardew valley fainting and a good thing it's raining right now maybe we could continue uh going to the mines and finally our eggplants are ready to be harvested yum yum and it's like we just paid uh 900 gold oh we have gave carrot here two of them that's fine Although we've painted, guys, it's not uh, totally zero uh, because we're able to gather uh, not just the materials, but also the experience from it, from doing something uh, productive. Okay, for the quality sprinkler, we need uh, one gold. All right, looks like we really need to <laughs> dig deeper into the mines this time. For now, let's just go ahead and harvest our eggplants. And hey, look at this, guys. Our apple trees, all our apple trees are have matured except for this little guy here, which soon to be. So we have four apples from that. <laughs> Hello, chickens. Good thing you're all inside because it's raining. You might catch cold. Stay inside, please. And uh, looks like in this case, we need to uh, store ourselves some eggs because we're going to be making, we're going to be cooking, right? An egg is going to be, it's one of the essentials in cooking. Uh, let's just go ahead. Uh, maybe we can, we can cook using a mayonnaise. Something like that. Maybe we'll store 20 of them and these eggs. These fresh eggs inside the fridge. Let's see what we could cook. We could cook a fried egg. What else we can cook here? <laughs> I do have a lot of uh, wheat, uh, which we need to convert into a wheat flour. So we can cook pancakes and it will uh, not only give us health and energy, but also plus two foraging, which is really great. Uh, let's see. Um, how can we turn raw wool into... No, not this one. Oh, okay. A seed maker. We can place a crop here and it will uh, turn it into a seed. I need to craft a wheat. Is there anything that we could use? Oh, this one will work. Is There's a bait maker. Place a fish inside to create a targeted bait. Produces bait on a regular basis. The worms are self-sufficient. Oh, this is really, really useful okay and yeah we've collected 500 gold from Demetrius request for a fresh melon not bad let's go ahead and sell this job and uh the frozen tear will try and drop it from uh drop it to uh gunter's place it's now 10 a.m looks like we're gonna have to go ahead and finish what we were doing yesterday uh man that was a bit frustrating because there's only one level left for us to get to the elevator but we just ran out of time and we fainted we paid like a thousand gold it was not productive that productive but i'm looking not only looking at the financial aspect of the game but also the experience that we gain from that we're able to gain mining experience we are able to gather some materials and all those good stuff but suppose yeah it's, it's good to learn from the mistake that i've did yesterday that means i should take a look at the at the time be mindful of it when going down to the mine so i won't faint again at least that is within my control hi penny oh penny likes frozen tear okay but I, I will need to give it to gunther oh hey there you go i'm going to go inside i just wanted a quiet moment okay hey don't look penny i, I need to get some oh what are you doing in the <laughs> i'm so sorry ah you want cola you want cola uh you're always sad and and jojo cola has caffeine maybe this will make you happy oh i'm so sorry that as, as oh, oh my gosh she absolutely hates this how many hearts do we have with her we only have now eight or three hearts i'm so sorry dear how about this hazelnut okay i'll make it up to you dear i'll make it up all righty we are back let's head straight down the mines hopefully we'll this time we'll be able to reach level 65 okay back back from where we've started guys that's fine and uh, i want to level up our combat and also to fulfill the 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 adventurous quest quest bulletin board all right now we're at this level 62 there's a lot of uh, goofy things here and a ghost and i think the ghost is gonna go down after two hits one last hit it will go down no okay uh one last hit there you go two two more hits and then there you go haha <laughs> two hits so we got a gold ore a solar essence and a refined core it's not bad but look at that guys at the top part our pets cannot wait cannot wait to see us uh, we've leveled up our our combat i think 
They're, they're too excited to see us, guys. Look at this. Here's one for you. Here's one. Here's two. Here's three. Oh, what a welcoming level. <laughs> right off the bat, they're, they're here. Can't wait to welcome us to give us a warm hug. Say hi to us. Look at this. Especially this ghost. Ah, I see. Because today, the, the uh, spirits are so annoyed. That's why there's a lot of monsters here. Hooray! We're now at level 64 and it's still 6 p.m. We did a great job going down up to 65. Hopefully, we could go down further, right? 70? Or, yeah, up to 70. If we can. More enemies here. Looks like they're having a party. Ah, hey, hey, more cave carrots. Yum, yum. And also some, uh, what was that? Oh, this one. Unfortunately, our inventory is full. Let's just eat this blackberry. Finally, we are now at level 65. <laughs> We have the elevator. Okay, it's now 11 p.m. Well, at least... Oh, wait. What's happening to the... F <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, it's now 11 p.m. Let's head straight home. At least we have uh, one iron ore and a bat remaining that we could say hi to. All right, at least I learned from my mistake. I've noticed the time. Almost I didn't. So uh, this time should be fine, right? We should not faint anymore. Uh, let's just uh, get all these iron ores ready. Okay. So we have an iron ore and a coal. They should... Oh, we also have this... Aquamarine, a sh shimmery blue-green gem. And also four carrot cave. Awesome. Okay, let's head straight home. We still have two hours in-game before we faint again. All right, you guys, you have... Oh, we're full though. We'll just collect it tomorrow, but uh, uh, I want the time to be to reset and uh, let's just go ahead and collect this pine tar i just threw the hazelnut away oh i want to keep all the fish because i'm planning of uh, making a dish from a fish or uh converting them into a uh, fish bait and this pine tar is going straight to our shipping bin and the mix seeds going straight to our uh normal chest that's on top of our house and that is it for the day oh oh 158 Oh man, no, please. Hopefully I won't. Oh, I fainted again. No, oh, I should, yeah, I should have. That's fine. I will, at least we've leveled up our combat to level four and we have now plus five HP and we have a new crafting. We can now craft a warrior ring. That's awesome, right? Warrior ring, because we're a warrior. Not just a farmer, but also a warrior. Warrior farmer. <laughs> and good morning, everyone. We have now 30,000 gold. That's a lot, man. And the spirits today are so displeased. Looks like they've oh, they've had enough in our in our mining adventure uh, two days ago. And tomorrow's going to be a beautiful day. What do we have for breakfast? Uh, a fried egg. Yeah, let's cook one, two, three, four... I'm going to be eating egg, um, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Hey, see, look at this. Our cranberries are ready to be harvested. Haha. <laughs> ah, this is so, this is so fun. It makes me happy, man. This read, re these red cranberries popping out. They're just bouncing on the ground. That's so satisfying. I like to buy a pumpkin from you. My daughter and I want to carve. Okay. Okay, Caroline. A pumpkin. Let's see if we have. And yeah, we do have. There you go. That's one one pumpkin for Caroline. Hey, he gave us a rare disc. Awesome. Gunther can tell you more about this if you donate them in the museum. <laughs> nice. Good boy. You found a lot of useful things. And now let's say hi to our yummy chickens. Yo, yummy, cute, cuddly, adorable chickens in the house. Ah, they were so hungry yesterday. They finished all the hay that we put inside. Let's just refill all of them. So, um, this coop can handle eight chickens. Let's count one, two, we have four inside. And, uh, uh, we need one more chicken, right? Oh, there's already four. There's already eight. One, two, eight. There's three here. And there, this, 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 that's the eight. Looks like we need to expand our coop. But before I do that, I would really like to also invest in a barn. So it looks like we need to plan ahead. Uh, we need to open this part here. Let's see, where can we, uh, where can we put our barn? I don't know. I haven't planned really. All right, done watering the plants. Hey, hello. Hello, Leia's gift. I should visit Leia sometimes, right? Because she's just, you know, she just already opened the door for me to say hi to her anytime, anywhere I want. But uh, in the meantime, let's just uh, explore a bit our farm. I'm thinking of where to put the barn. Maybe uh, we'll put the barn here. There's a lot of hay. Maybe at, maybe at this side here. Yeah, th this one here. Barn would be great at this side, right? There's a lot of hay that we could play around with. And then the ducks are going to be here by the pond or by the lake. And we have one salmon berry from the bat. Thank you so much. You are so generous, bat. There's a lot of you. Like, I see your eyes everywhere in the cave, but you only just gave me one. At least there's one. Okay, it's 3 p.m. Let's, 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 let's go to Leia's place. I, I want to give her something. Maybe uh, this uh, salmon berry that we just 
picked up from the bat cave i think he's gonna love this hey leah what you doing oh we have a cutscene nice oh hi snap come in come in and it's looking like we got off the recording guys something came up thank you so much again for hanging out for my videos you can look at the lower part of the screen and don't forget to like and subscribe and maybe always walk with patience and kindness because this is what love is see you in the next video i'm so sorry i'll make it up to you guys Bye bye